first period. We still have Ampalayo sitting on the bench. There's a one-on-one -on -one play again for Patrimonio. He's just going to power his way in and over the backboard. Oh, that could have been dangerous because his fault. He starts off well for the team. One-on-one -on -one play there for Alvin Patrimonio, and there is going to be a blocking foul called on Harmon Codinera. And the basket will not be counted. There was a foul way before that. Second, Deerfoot's hot dogs display that they were not going to get intimidated. They were going to play their game, and they're going to be patient in their offensive pattern. And as you pointed out, it is Alvin Patrimonio that they will go to. The reason they keep on holding to the ball. Villa Pandas being picked up by Chito Loisaga. They try to work it inside. Good catch by Alvin Patrimonio. Patrimonio working where he works best on the inside. He's got four in the ball. And he has also a conference high in this uh, all Filipino conference with 35 points. Good block there against the street of the first period. We still have Ampalayo sitting on the bench. There's a one-on-one -on -one play again for Patrimonio. He's just going to power his way in and over the backboard. Oh, that could have been dangerous because his takeoff was so strong like a bullet in spite of the fact that Mamaril blocked him on the air and as he backed off, he went over the railing and one of the fans backed off too instead of catching his body. I think the fan was scared with that momentum. I've been shocked a little bit by that play, misses the first free throw. He's only got four points in ball game, all of them on the inside game. But Andy has pulled down Super. five rebounds, three and two. And he has come up with two shot blocks. Isa. We have a couple of substitutions first. We have uh, Sunny coming in for Isaac, and we have Chito Loisaga coming in for Tukut. But the fact is, you know, you realize that Cordinera has been boxing out Mamari from the boards. Letting Albin go to the defensive board. Change. He has now come up with six points and trying to control the boards with seven rebounds. Two and five. Glass shot coming from the main man of the Pure Foods. Patrimonio Bachito Leisaga just uses his body, gets Patrimonio out of the position that he loves. Sunny drives in towards the hoop, but misses. And we have a fast break in the, in the offing for the Pure Foods team. And before Alvin Patrimonio could really take off, was foul on a go against Loisaga. Look at the statistics here after this uh, slow mo. Purefoods took the fast break in the first quarter, nine to two. Shot better from the field, 57 to 43 percent. The pass being sent into the ball game for Willie Henderalau. And Henderalau of Purefoods converted and contributed four points as he directed the first quarter operations. Two out of two from the 15-foot line. Faith in himself and also believe in the force. Dante Gonzalgo, Loisaga, and Mamaril playing with two personal fouls apiece. Villa Panda with two. And here comes Alvin Patrimonio. Got to take it into his own hands, partner. He realized that he's had problems pulling up against Chico Loisaga. So this time he came out and got the ball, work it facing towards the basket. Uses his strong move there. Gets the foul from the street and has a chance for a three-point play. By the way, Dynamite is now playing with four personal fouls and he remains on the floor. That's his shot. The main man can't go wrong. Out safely. Here is Joey being pressed by Marquez. Shot block by Alvin Patrimonio. It's a good clean block. Patrimonio's fourth. And you will see that in our slow-mo. The force of Patrimonio. Joey Lewis loses balance. Really clean upstairs, clean downstairs, and a good block by Alvin. He's being enjoyed by Pure Foods. They had it at 19 at 76.57. We haven't had experience any deadlock. Shouted by Distrito. Almost got the first step. If he continued. Inside to Alvin. Good catch. No a, basket. That was a good foul there by Gonzalo because Alvin. Third time that Anejo Ramos led by one point. And they've been really pressing now on the main man. They cannot take Found it for granted. Use of Distrito, who had to leave because of exhaustion. And Joey has come up with crucial points in the last two minutes. You know, Kapasher came up with a block, but Joey did not give up. Patrimonio, a little bit too strong. Here he comes again. 
Baskets will not count. There was a foul before that. A patrimonial with the second servings, as you like to say, Pingoy. He makes the first free throw. 21 points for Albin Patrimonio, 84% free throw shooter in this uh, championship series. And he's been averaging just below 23 points per game and putting in 37 minutes as his average in the championship series. Side, here's Jaworski, picked up by Jerry. Trap deflected. There's going to be a blocking foul on Chito to prepare the fast break play for the Pure Foods team. Patrimonio for to the 15 foot line. Watch this trap. Patrimonio was there. I think if Mamaril stretched just a little bit and quick with the hands, he may have kept possession. That's true. Patrimonio, good anticipation, really got high up into the air. 22 points for Albin. 23 points right now and a seven point lead with 226 left in this ball game. The main man of Pure Foods, he has to continue that role. He has to extend himself and also show that leadership quality for his co-teammates from the floor. Stop going to Ampalayo. At this point, who wants the ball in the part of Pure Foods? They have to come out. Yes, an interception. Another counter interception. Capacho gets possession. Three on two break. It was Joe Lass that took it away from Dante Gonzalgo. And follow up by Patrimonio. Your main man, Andy. It's gone. That'll be his six. Ten seconds left in the shot clock for Pure Foods to execute a play. Jerry working on the outside. And Albin with an offensive rebound and a miss on the follow up. But he'll go to the line. 22 foul, foul on Mamaril. And that'll be his fifth personal foul. We're in the pressure cooker at this point, Pingoy. This is definitely a cardiac game, and we are experiencing a cardiac finish. He is made of steel, and what runs on his veins? Ice water. The main man of pure foods. He on the second free throw, Añejo.